So I'm just sitting here thinking about this old story about when I was young. You know, me, my friends, we all came up in the South Bronx. So eating out for us was going to the corner Chinese restaurant, getting four chicken wings and pork fried rice. Or better yet, going up to the Spanish spot and getting coochie Fritos. But one summer, you know, we work, we got our little summer youth checks and we happy. We think we impressing these girls and we gonna take them to a fancy restaurant. So we all get dressed up and take them to a restaurant that we thought we was balling out. The restaurant had real silverware. It had the menus with the leather back and a waiter. So the waiter comes to our table and the waiter's like, um, what will you be having? So we all look at each other because we never really been in this situation before. So we act like we read the menu. And then we're like, um, well, what do you recommend, sir? And the waiter's like, um, you know, here are the specials for tonight, but I highly recommend the filet mignon. So right when he said that, my man's girl, and she was bad too, she looked away to square in his face and was like, Filet? I don't want no fish. So the waiter's like, <laughs> and all of us are like, what? So the whole table's quiet. Nobody got the heart to tell her that she sounds bananas. So me being the wise guy that I am, I look down at her and I'm like, um, baby girl, like, you know, you like steak? You know, why, why don't you get a steak? She, she'll take a steak. And she looked away and be like, yeah, I like steak. Give me a steak. So why am I telling y'all this story? Number one, if you don't know what you're talking about, shut your mouth. It's okay. You will save yourself a lot of embarrassment. Or number two, humble yourself. Ask questions. Simply say, I don't know. Can you elaborate? Can you explain to me what that means? You might learn something. Or better yet, you might save yourself so much embarrassment by being the person that says, I don't want no fish, when somebody asks you if you want a filet mignon. Think about it. Peace and love make every move a power move, and I'll catch you all on the next video. What's up, guys? Thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video. Truly appreciate you. If you like anything you heard here today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you know anybody that can benefit from this message, feel free to share. Peace and love.